¿Por qué decir nombres de dioses, astros, espumas de un océano invisible, polen de los jardines más remotos, si nos duele la vida, si cada día llega desgarrando la entraña, si cada noche cae convulsa, asesinada, si nos duele el dolor en alguien, en un hombre al que no conocemos pero está presente a todas horas, y es la víctima, y el enemigo, y el amor, y todo lo que nos falta para ser enteros. Nunca digas que es tuya la tiniebla, no te debas de un sorbo la alegría, mira a tu alrededor, hay otro, siempre hay otro, lo que él respira es lo que a ti te asfixia, lo que come es tu hambre, muere con la mitad más pura de tu muerte. El despojo Me arrebataron la razón del mundo y me dijeron Gasta tus años componiendo este rompecabezas sin sentido No hay más Un acto es una estatua rota Una palabra es solo la imagen deformada en un espejo ¿Qué vas a amar? ¿Un cuerpo que se pudre? ¿Ese pantano lento en que te ahogas? ¿O un alma que no existe? ¿Qué puedes esperar? El tiempo es lo continuo y si dices mañana mientes, pues dices hoy. Ni siquiera se muere, algo muy leve cambia y sigues dura en piedra, creciendo en vegetal y otra vez despertando en lo que eras. Otra vez, otra vez. Me dijeron, no busques, nada se te ha perdido. Y los vi desde lejos ocultar lo que roban y reír.
Top of My Voice, by Vladimir Mayakovsky. 1. She loves me loves me not. My hands I pick. And having broken my fingers. Fling away. So the first daisy heads. One happens to flick. Are plucked. And guessing. Scattered into May. Let a cut and shave. Reveal my gray hairs. Let the silver of the years. Ring out endlessly. Shameful common sense. I hope, I swear. Will never come. To me. 2. It's already 2. No doubt, you've gone to sleep. In the night. The Milky Way. With silver filigrees. I don't hurry. And there is no point in me. Waking and disturbing you. With express telegrams. 3. The sea goes to weep. The sea goes to sleep. As they say. The incident has petered out. The love boat of life. Has crashed on Philistine reefs. You and I. Are quits. No need to reiterate. Mutual injuries. Troubles. And griefs. 4. Do you see? In the world what a quiet sleeps. Night tributes the sky. With silver constellations. In such an hour as this. One rises and speaks. To ear is. History. And world creation. 5. I know the power of words, I know words toxin. They're not the kind applauded by the boxes. From words like these coffins burst from the earth. And on their own four open legs stride forth. It happens they reject you, unpublished, unprinted. But saddle girth tightening words gallop ahead. See how the centuries ring and trains crawl. To lick poetry's calloused hands. I know the power of words. Seeming trifles that fall. Like petals beneath the heel taps of dance. But man with his soul, his lips, his bones a broken bar. Приди, возьми, мне ничего не надо. Люблю, отдам, и не люблю, отдам. Я заменить хочу тебя, но если я говорю, что перейду в тебя, не верь мне, бедное дитя, я лгу. О, эти руки с пальцами, как лозы, открытые и влажные глаза, и раковины маленьких ушей, как блюдца полной любовной песни, и крылья ветром выгнутые туго. Не верь мне, бедное дитя, Я лгу, я буду порываться, как казнимый, но не могу я через отчуждение переступить, и не могу твоим крылом плеснуть, и не могу мизинцем твоим коснуться глаз твоих, глазами твоими посмотреть. Ты восток рад сильнее меня, ты песня о себе, а я наместник дерева и неба и осужден твоим судом. За песню.
recognition through death. For the last four decades, he had been living in the town of elites. But, in spite of all efforts, he was ignored. Nobody thought to extend a relation with him. Everyone wanted to cultivate relation with the well to do so as to increase his honor and be recognized. It is a common trend to make friends with high ups. So, he was no exception. The inhabitants of this town often remained in quest of aristocratic company, how they could see the trodden one. This was the sole cause of the rejection of this poor soul. He tried every trick to be known, but sorry to say that no one even talked of his poverty. He was mostly ignored. In such circumstances, he forgot his own being to who was he. Why was he residing in that town? Sometimes, the pangs of hunger recalled him his actuality. But, this was a momentous recognition. Again he was lost into nothingness. Today, when he was murdered, townsmen along with the guards tried to know about him. Policemen were worried to investigate the murder who committed this homicide. Who are his heirs? Without the legatee how could the proceedings be progressed? It was because the heirs often greased the pun of policemen to investigate the matter. Nobody denied the broad daylight murder. The ground drenched with blood was the witness for this demise. Many of the townsmen accepted his being now. But they did not know him. So to say, nobody knew about his friends or foes. It is a general rule that in adversity near and dear ones leave a person. Now who could invite such a predicament after knowing him? After his murder, the ignored was discussed by everybody. Everyone discussed the helpless even for a moment or two. The city guards who ignored him now worried to look into the matter. The next day the local and the national newspapers will publish the report along with his photo without any fee. In this way it will be proved that life is far inferior to death. Life gave nothing to him save hunger, poverty, demand and unemployment. Life has nothing to give to a helpless poor person. The fact is that life has two standards, if you don't believe it, visit a hospital and look at these standards. Those who claim hospitality and are a blot on the fair name of doctors ignore the poverty lying in the corridors. This poverty bears the bitterness but does not speak a word. On the other hand the elites when come to a hospital sit in a doctor's room, enjoy chatting with nurses, get good reception, prescription, etc. Police stations are considered to be death places for culprits but these places nurture the wrongdoers. Ironically it is a safe haven for such people. They are treated as elites and the oppressed are ignored. Double standard enjoys a prominent position in every walk of life. Life denies the wretched humanity. 
How could this double standard accept his being? Today, death proved that it had no double standard. A nameless person got acquaintance among the public and the private circles by death. It is not enough. The very next day, papers will prove his being. Because the policemen were busy in the corpse's inspection and the press reporters were preparing the reports and shooting the dead, the ignored with their cameras. This is the age when a person is indifferent to his neighbor. How it could be possible that somebody would bother about the cause of this murder? A very few people knew that it was a heinous offense. The fact was that for the last few months he was eating a big part of meal of Chaudhary's dog. Nobody knew about it. But for how long? The dog became weak day by day. The Chaudhary could not bear the broken health of his pet. So, his rage was out of control and that's all on the other hand, the deceased was forced to make friendship with the dog leaving human beings underscore 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 just for crumbs. The fell. Beings denied to recognize him as a human being. But he tried his best to be close to every person of the town. Although the dog was Chaudhary's pet yet it accepted the friendship with an ignored and forgotten human being. It was the recognition with the dog that kept him alive. Otherwise he could have been murdered by the cruel hands of hunger. Настоящий поэт, э, если он настоящий, он не может быть э, неверующим человеком.
искусство — это одно из самых бескорыстных деяний человека. Мысль искусства — это молитва. Это моя молитва.
जानू बाबा दीदी ना बोल भी ना तुम बोल भी ना बाबा दीदी ना रॉकी के भालू बाशे आमी ना बाबा वो रॉकी के भालू बाशे पोशाक के तुम्हें रॉकी भी दिए था ना बाबा दीदी को तो तुम्हें शून्य में ना बाबा वो तुम्हारे बॉडी में उस शून्य रॉकी भी दिए था ये दायित्व तुम्हारे पुरी था आमी वो रॉकी के भालू बाशे
अर्ज किया है रीत बुत की शराब साई मांगे इस कर बला सिया बला पाई मांगे रीत बुत की शराब साई मांगे इश्क कर बला सिया बला पाई मांगे उस तलू के दोष बरा गोल नोस चश्म बकफ निकला सबने हाथों हाथ लिया धूम में साया शजर ठहरा धूम में छाया शजर ठहरा कोई उसे नमूदे सहर समझा वो पै के फर तो सांस के सब पर जो साथ पाया था कब चला पाया था अपने साय से लुट गया आईना पत्थरों से अपनी कितियों की बीनाई मांगे लफ्सों की बेनवा दस्तक फाहताओं से बेरे आई मांगे पारसाई मांगे सरा सहरा बारिश सहरा दरिया बारिश सहरा बादलों से रिहाई मांगे जीस का हर शख्स फिलाए बे रिहाई मांगे रीत बुत की शराशाई मांगे इश्कर बला सिया बला पाई मांगे शुक्रिया जी Étranger de Charles Baudelaire. Qui aimes-tu le mieux, homme énigmatique Dis, ton père, ta mère, 
ta sœur ou ton frère Je n'ai ni père, ni mère, ni sœur, ni frère. Tes amis Vous vous servez là d'une parole dont le sens m'est resté jusqu'à ce jour inconnu. Ta patrie J'ignore sous quelle latitude elle est située. La beauté Je l'aimerais volontiers, déesse et immortelle. L'or Je le hais, comme vous haïssez Dieu. Hé, hey, qu'aimes-tu donc, extraordinaire étranger J'aime les nuages, les nuages qui passent là-bas, les merveilleux nuages. 